Initializing automatic power systems, cleaning, cleaning, loading memory systems, recalculating values, adding special resources, setting host name, configuring network interfaces, setting configurations, setting the system clock, give root password for maintenance, and initialize system. read that in a second. Hey guys, welcome back to After Work Gaming. We are here checking out the demo for a game called Clarice. Now, this is due later in the year, but it is a point-and-click adventure, and the only thing I know uh, for certain is we're the AI assisting this guy who's some researcher, professor, doctor, I don't really know for certain. Uh, and that's pretty much it. So I figured we'd play the demo sort of to get a taste of what the game is. I checked with the devs. The mechanics are some, or at least a, por a part, of what will be in the final game, and the story is just a little bit of a taste of what happens in the full game. So, figured we'd play this and then wait for the full thing to come out. Okay, uh, so let's just begin with uh, the professor talking. Good morning, Clarice. As punctual as always. I was waiting for you. I see that it was a good idea to program you with that automatic ignition system. As artificial intelligence, you could be on for an unlimited time, but the energy on this facility isn't finite. Uh, isn't infinite, and also, I guess you deserve a break. <laughs> okay. Oh, Clarice, today is an important day. We are about to finish all the work we've done during the last months. There has been a lot of sleepless nights, so much stress. <coughs> oh my god, he's coughing up blood. You see? This fatigue has been affecting me for days. <laughs> I don't really know how funny that is. So... Forgetfulness, man? Yeah, he needs some sleep. As I was saying, today we are about to conclude a stage that I'm sure will lead us to a world full of hope. This will bring justice, peace, and equality for everyone. I know that Clarice, my beloved wife, would be proud of us. Oh, so we're, I guess he's a widower and we're named after his, his, uh, late wife? Meow! Yes, and proud of you too, Mr. Cat. <laughs> hmm. So, if my estimations are correct today, we should fix the last details of the behavior of the four main devices. <coughs> Sorry. I would like you to understand the welfare that we are about to bring to the world. The importance of this project in the history of mankind. No more wars. No more hunger. No more injustice. Never more. We are going to change the system. What do you think, Mr. Cat? Should we start? Meow. Ha 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 ha! That's the spirit. <coughs> oh man, I'm starting to feel a little sick. Clarice, please, could you do a fast scan of my vital signs? Okay. Scanner mode. Configuration scan. Okay, so nothing here. Maybe if we scan something. Okay, body temperature 37.8. A little high. Pulse rate 115 beats. Breathing frequency, 27 breaths. Blood pressure, 140 over 90. That's a little high. Diagnosis, high levels of fatigue, stress, restlessness, possible viral activity. Medical procedure, repose and proceed to a medical check as soon as possible. Okay. Let me see. Repose and medical check. Come on, don't be so hypochondriac, Clarice. I really appreciate your motherly instinct. Okay. <laughs> But I have no time for that. It's only a low fever and a little lack of sleep. I can't waste time. <coughs> Tomorrow we can rest. So, let's keep the hard work. Yeah, it's an it's, it's an early build. This is just a preview trick. Jesus, you are really coughing up blood, man. Uh, I just want to say, like, there will be some typos. So, I don't really... It's not really getting in the way here. Clarice, would you check my personal computer and tell me if there is something important in the mail or news? Okay. Uh, but first, yes, Matt. Dr. Matt, see, that's what I'm saying. Dr. Matt Simons, human being, biped, organic life form. They are also known under the generic name men, although that term is ambiguous and is also used to refer to males and, in particular, adult males. Human beings possess mental capacity that allows them to invent, learn, and use complex linguistic structures. They are a complex unity between body and mind. He is my creator. Okay, let's check this computer. 
SHW Investors Building Better Worlds. Project Files. Uh, tech Arm Plan, Exploded View. Alright, schematics for something. News Delivery Service, World Today. No, just a thing. Intern leaks in SHW investors ensure that the mysterious project led by Dr. Matt Simons, that's this guy, is about to conclude. Thomas Anderson, Washington, September 2nd, 2019. Reliable sources ensure that Dr. Matt Simons is in the final stage to complete his project. After achieving what a lot of investors and some governments patronize his in initiative, Dr. Matt Simons reached a deal with the SHW investors to channel all the investments and help him to manage the funds. SHW investors have developed a total new lab facility where Dr. Matt Simons could finish his last steps of the project. The project is a totally top secret. Is totally top secret. All the investors and governments have no idea about what Dr. Simons is working on, but considering his great trajectory, which includes the greatest awards in the field of science and his commitment uh, to human rights and nature, nobody doubts that we can hope for something that could change the world. Dr. Simons has never issued extended information about a project that everybody is waiting to know about, only a code name, Project Renaissance. Hope we can offer more specific information in the next days. Okay, check the mail. Uh, August, huh, Spike Spiegel. Those mails are checked and answered, don't waste time with, all right, fine. Is it anything with a V? Yeah, okay. Dr. Alice Brooke, September 2nd, 2019. Hi, Matt. So, how's it going for the savior of the world? <laughs> Sorry, still funny to me that the nickname the press has given you. At least it's better than my Dr. Frankenstein. Have you read the news today? What about the rumor saying that your work is almost done? Is that true? Check the news, buddy. I can't wait to know what you've done. I, If you were out there and you could see the expectations you've created, contact me whenever you can. Uh, let's reply... Leave it, Clarice. I think I'm still able to manage my personal relationships. All right, fine. Fine. Okay, we're done. So, let me see. A mail from Alice. Okay, I'll answer her tomorrow. And one of that sensationalist rumors that pretend to become a news. Mm. Okay. Seriously, man, you are coughing up a lot of blood. How are you not concerned? However, this time they seem to be right. I guess someone at SHW Investors is richer today. Human greed. Mm. Okay, so while I take some, while I make some arrangements, Clarice, please, um, could you take a look here and make a fast scan of the main device? Sure. Oh, and I almost forgot. I disabled the security system so you can enter and check the devices. Okay, let's scan this thing. Can I scan anything else? Nope. Scan this thing. Cool. Main device control system. Back to normal. Normal mode? No. First device is a mechanical arm of high assembly system. Second is a sophisticated rotate system, the only one in the world that can be programmed with multiple speeds. And the third is a high pressure laser beam to make accurate solders. Cool. All ready, Clarice? Okay, what do you think, Mr. Cat? Are we ready? Meow! <laughs> okay, let's keep up the good work. Okay. Clarice, do me a favor. Could you set up the mechanical arm and the high-precision laser beam? I want to check that there are no problems with these devices. Okay. Can I, before we do that... Yes, I can scan everything else. Let me scan everything else first. Let's start... Start with the cat. Dr. Matt's cat, a mammal. Four-legged animal, sleeping most of the time. Okay. What's the cat sitting on? A high-tech computational chemical device. Current status, not working. It's on the shelves. Personal diary of Dr. Matt. Very cool. Can we... No? Light fixtures? No? What's this? Ge uh, electric generator that supplies the lab with energy. We know this is his computer. Dr. Matt's personal computer. It has a lot of valuable information. What's this? Okay, a preservation device that keeps these experimental plants in a perfect state of temperature and feeding. Very cool. Um, hmm. Okay, you know what? Let's read the scanned files before we start setting anything up. Let's go back to normal. Perfect. Main display, so that's his computer. A system that allows to check by project, grant the news and important information. Granted access is available always for functional work and activities linked with the research operative system based on CLRS 2.0. Okay, cool. 
Mr. Cat. Mr. Cat. Uh, Dr. Mask has sleep most of the time. Cats are often valued by humans for companionship. Cats are similar in anatomy to other felids with a strong, flexible body, sharp, retractable claws, and teeth adapted to killing small prey. Domestic cats are similar in size to the other members of the genus Felis. Okay. Battery, that's this thing. Uh, supplies the lab. The, the activity of the lab needs an incredible amount of energy. The generator is a high-tech system that regulates and distributes the flow of the energy in a better way. Necessary when working. Okay. Chemical device, that's the thing the cat's sitting on. That device is capable of mixing different and incompatible elements to ensure a good and stable mixture. The scan detects three different elements inside the different with different compositions. The compositions are unidentifiable. Okay. Main device, so this thing. Systems have two operating. One is a system security and the other is the activation control, the central part of the experiment. Composed uh, for three different devices, each device has a unique function in the task of assembling the full prototype of the research. Operate with caution. Okay. Um, we've read a thing about the doctor. P device. Oh, so this thing. Preservation, state of feeder net. It's supposed to be a very important part of the researcher's uh, project. These plants are a new sort of organism that can grow in any kind of ground. Experiment in progress. Okay. And the diary. Two pages. All right, so June 21st, 2019. The first words are always complicated. Moreover, it's not. I'm not a person who finds it easy to express my thoughts. But I think it would be fine to do a tracking about the last months of this project. Actually, I'm waiting for SHW uh, investors to confirm that the lab facilities are ready to receive me. After years of investigation and hard work, now I need a place for these last stages of the project, and specifically, a place out of the press and away from investors, governments, a place to work away from all that madness and with the appropriate technology to complete it. Sometimes I feel like I've sold my soul to the devil making a deal with SHW investors, but unfortunately in this world, money is necessary to afford scientific research. The funds provided from private businesses, governments, patrons, oligarchs, and lobbies are necessary subjects for a major purpose. Although I don't like to have to deal with them, I know that all of them uh, don't do this for the welfare of mankind. They all, the only thing they think about are benefits, numbers, businesses, all that stuff. The history tells us that every single great discovery in the field of science has had a dangerous use in a way other than uh, in some other way or has been used for a different purpose than expected. I will not allow that now. I have to review all the research information and prepare to move soon. Okay. And uh, July 6, 2019. Today's the day. I have moved to the new lab facilities. I have to say it, it's awesome. They have given all that I requested and much more. I think that I can complete the project in about three or four months. We are so close. SHW Investors offers me a team of support for the research, but I truly don't believe that I can have confidence with them. Moreover, I think it would be a waste of time to explain the project to a new team. Alice, I guess she's the one that emailed us already, uh, Alice Brooke. Uh, Alice also offered to help, and I know she can help, but I don't want to involve her in case I fail with this. It could ruin her career, and I think our relationship could be a problem. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm gonna go Matt. Um... We are so close, not only professionally. We never have had intimate contact, but we know there is something more than professional admiration. Uh, this is starting to seem like a teenager's diary. My son would be laughing at me if he could read this. I've taken Mr. Cat with me. I think he would be a good research mate. And also, I can't wait to use the vending machine for cat food that I requested. Okay. So no mention of us, huh? All right. Let's, uh, let's set up the first one. What is it, tech arm? Oh, wait, 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 I know. Hold on. We saw this in the project files. Okay, so... Got a piece of paper here, because I always do. It's this, like, cylinder thing with a stripe. This, like, crankshaft, I guess, that has two... Like, one shorter, one longer. And then this thing, which is some sort of flange, I guess. It has, like, this... Whatever. Flange. Okay. So let's set this up now. We have yeah, this thing is the one with the with the line down the side. Of these three, it's this one because check it out. This one has like weird lines on it. We didn't see that in the schematic. And then this has feet. Nobody cares about these feet. And I would bet dollars to donuts it's this one because this one seems to have like a weird little pattern on it. 
right? Assemble. Nice. Cool. I like the graphics in this game, by the way. They're pixely, but they're like... I don't know, they're, they're, they're really cool to, like, bring along, bring across what's going on. Alright, that's it, Clarice. Thank you. Could you go for, uh... Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Uh, Clarice, uh, once again... Oh, Clarice. Once again, that problem with the energy system. Clarice, can you fix it? Yeah, I can fix it. Doc, can we talk about why your power, like, off indicator is horrifying? Okay. Ah. Hello? Uh, energy system panel control, energy supply. Okay. Frequency voltage. Oh, check it out. It beeps faster. Maybe we're getting closer. Yeah, okay, so we're here. Right? Now to monkey with the voltage, right? There we go. Oh, hey, cool. Energy supply going up. Thanks. Hope we don't have to deal with that more times today. Could you continue with the work? Sure. Um, oh. Doc. You got mail. Jack Blow, September 2nd, 2019. Look at this, Jack Blow admitting an error. Praise the Lord. Uh, he behaved like an asshole. Okay, I have no time for that. Clarice, could you answer that mail for me? Please be gentle. Okay, Jack Blow. Dear Matt, our last conversation didn't end so well. I want to apologize. I was blinded by the jealousy. Since we were students, you've always been one step ahead of me. Your career and merits are unquestionable. What I'm trying to say is that I don't think all the horrible things that I told you. Sorry. Please, let me know if you need something. S.J. Blow. Why? Polite, impolite, do not reply. Um, polite. Hi, Jack. There's no need for apologies. We are scientists, but, for, uh, but first, we are humans, and as humans, we commit errors. I'm about to finish here, so what if we meet when I leave this crazy place and go for some beers? It's good to hear from you, M. Simons. Okay, what if I was impolite? Uh, good morning, Jack. It's good that you apologize. You admit that you were an asshole, as you understand I'm not interested in having any kind of contact with you. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, let's be polite. He wanted us to be gentle. Thanks, Clarice. You have very good manners. I do have very good manners. Thank you. All right, let's go back to this. Set up the laser beam. Um. Oh, wait. Oh, I see. Can I move this? No, I can move it like this, though. Okay, it goes down to zero because we cut the cord. What, what is this? Move it up. Okay. Rotate. Uh-huh. Okay. I do have an idea, though. Can we... Right, something like this, something like this. Nice. 100%. Perfect. Is something gonna come out here? Cool. Doc? Good work, Clarice. Well done. Okay. You know, I think you were right. I'm feeling really bad. I can't work properly this way, and it could be dangerous. Not at this point. Tomorrow will be a better day. I need some rest. You can shut down when you want, Clarice. See you tomorrow. Whoa. Okay. Um. Oh. The general security system has been activated. This action is not allowed. Okay, so we're ba so okay, so we're locked out, right? That's fine. Let's... I don't have to shut down, do I? Exit system? Yes? Huh. What 
the heck? Uh, cat? Meow. Is that, is he dead? Or at least passed out? Holy moly. Okay. Cool, I guess that was the demo. Or maybe there's more? Hold on. Clarice. Hmm? Okay. So, that was the demo. Very cool. Uh, I cannot wait for the full game, uh, because A, the mechanics are pretty fun, but I'm also very curious about what happened at the end of that demo. And uh, I kind of hope we get a little more explanation in the full game. In fact, I pretty much expect that we're going to get more explanation. Uh, anyway, if you guys enjoyed that, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. Let's me know that I'm doing something right. Let's me know that you guys want to see more of that stuff. If you have thoughts about the game, if you want to speculate ahead of the full release about what's going on, or if you just have something else that you want to tell me, by all means, leave a comment. Everything's welcome. And in any case, I'll see you all next time. Better than 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 better